Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Hit the subscribe button below before we begin and don't forget to like the video. Today we will be talking about 5 different ways you can make money in the stock market. The stock market is one of the most popular investment vehicles for investors looking to grow their wealth. Investing in the stock market can be a great way to build long-term wealth, but it can also be a risky venture for those who lack knowledge and experience. Let's start with the way that most investors choose to work under. Number 1. Long-term investing. Long-term investing is a tried-and-true strategy that involves buying and holding stocks for an extended period of time. This strategy is popular among investors who are looking to build long-term wealth, as it allows them to benefit from the power of compounding over time. To be successful with long-term investing, you must choose companies that have a strong financial performance, good management, and a sustainable business model. You should also be patient and not get too caught up in short-term market fluctuations. Instead, you should focus on the long-term prospects of the company and the overall trend of the market. Try not to let your emotions control your decision-making. One key aspect of long-term investing is diversification. You should consider building a diversified portfolio of stocks across different sectors and industries. This can help to reduce risk and improve returns over the long-term. Another strategy that long-term investors can use is dollar-cost averaging. This involves investing a fixed amount of money on a regular basis, regardless of the current stock market conditions. By doing this, investors can benefit from buying stocks at different prices over time, which can help to reduce the impact of market volatility on their portfolio. Number 2. Trading This involves buying and selling stocks with the goal of making a profit in the short term. This strategy is more speculative and requires a lot of knowledge and experience to be successful. Traders need to be able to read market trends and make informed decisions based on market news and analysis. There are several different types of trading strategies including day trading, swing trading, and position trading. Day traders buy and sell stocks within a single day, while swing traders hold onto stocks for a few days or weeks. Position traders hold onto stocks for several months or even years. To be successful with trading, it's important to have a solid understanding of technical analysis and be able to identify trends in stock prices. Traders should also be disciplined and have a clear strategy in place to manage risk and maximize profits. One key strategy that traders can use is stop-loss orders. This involves setting a predetermined price at which a stock will be sold if it falls below that level. This can help to limit potential losses and protect the trader's capital. Another strategy that traders can use is taking advantage of market inefficiencies. This involves identifying stocks that are mispriced or undervalued based on their fundamentals. By buying these stocks at a discount, traders can potentially make a profit when the stock price eventually rises. Number 3. Dividend Investing Dividend investing involves buying stocks that pay regular dividends to shareholders. Dividends are a portion of a company's earnings that are distributed to shareholders on a regular basis. Dividend-paying stocks can provide a steady stream of income for investors and can be a good way to build a long-term portfolio. To be successful with dividend investing, it's important to choose stocks that have a history of paying dividends and have a sustainable business model. Investors should also look for companies with a good dividend yield, which is the amount of dividends paid out each year divided by the stock price. Another key aspect of dividend investing is reinvesting the dividends. This involves using the dividends received to purchase additional shares of the same stock. By doing this, investors can benefit from the power of compounding over time, which can help to boost returns and build long-term wealth. In addition to the strategies outlined above, there are several other strategies that investors can use to make money in the stock market. Number 4. Growth Investing Growth investing involves buying stocks in companies that are expected to grow faster than the overall market. These companies typically reinvest their earnings back into the business to fuel growth, rather than paying dividends to shareholders. To be successful with growth investing, investors need to identify companies with a strong growth potential and a sustainable competitive advantage. They should also be willing to pay a premium for these stocks, as they may have a higher price-to-earnings ratio than other stocks. One key aspect of growth investing is doing thorough research on the company and its industry. Investors should look for companies with a strong track record of revenue growth and earnings growth, as well as a strong management team and a clear growth strategy. Another strategy that growth investors can use is investing in exchange-traded funds, ETFs, or mutual funds that focus on growth stocks. This can provide a diversified portfolio of growth stocks, while also reducing the risk of investing in individual stocks. Number 5. Value Investing Value investing involves buying stocks that are undervalued by the market. These stocks may be priced lower than their intrinsic value, which means they have the potential to increase in value over time. To be successful with value investing, investors need to identify stocks that are trading at a discount to their intrinsic value. 
This may involve looking at the company's financial statements, industry trends, and other market factors. One key aspect of value investing is patience. Investors may need to hold onto these stocks for an extended period of time as it may take some time for the market to recognize the value of the stock. Another strategy that value investors can use is investing in dividend-paying value stocks. This can provide a steady stream of income while also providing the potential for capital appreciation over time. Therefore, to conclude, there are several ways to make money in the stock market, but each strategy requires a different approach and level of risk tolerance. With the right approach and a bit of luck, investors can potentially generate significant returns in the stock market over the long term. Find what works for you and watch your results come in as you get better and better at investing across all of the points mentioned. But of course, do your own research. I am not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice. Make sure to hit the subscribe button right now and don't forget to turn on the notifications for my next post. Have a great day and I will see you in the next one.